importer of French wine. Even in the 1600s, yes, the French made wine. So, but England and France went to war, so England said we're not going to import French wine anymore. Well, the English people said, yeah, but we still want wine. Well, England, the English government said, okay, we're still friends with Portugal, so what we're going to do is we're going to go down, we're going to take over the Portuguese grape industry. So even today, all the Portuguese support house all have Scottish names. There's Dewars, Dows, and if you look at all the courthouse, they're all Scottish names. So they went down and took over the industry. Okay, they put the wine in barrels, put it on the ship, they sent the ship off. Now England and France were of course, they had to take the long way around. By the time the wine got to England, the wine had spoiled on the high seas. The wine wasn't any good. Well, some smart fella down in Portugal said, well, wait a minute. Portugal. Alcohol is a preservative. So let's put alcohol in the wine, send the alcohol high. When we get it to England, we'll put some water in it, dilute it, so the alcohol is back down. So they did that, and it got to England. And yes, it preserved it. It got to England, the wine was fine. But the English people said, I'll be damned if you can dilute this. This is really good, just like this. Yeah. So they left it like that. Well, it took about eight years for the Portuguese industry to finally realize where the sugar levels to stop, how much alcohol the level to put in, etc. And that's when port was born in the early 1600s. Yeah.